crazy hacks and tricks on Instagram and YouTube and all over social media about these crazy masks and serums that have really funny, <laughs> basically ways of doing them. I've seen the magnetic one, the foam like super, the one that like basically just foams up on your face and makes you look really puffy like some kind of character and I've always wondered if they worked, is it just to put on Instagram and look funny? So I'm going to try the one that foams up and it doesn't list any benefits or what it's for, it just lists the ingredients so I want to try it out and see how I feel after. So this one is called One Bad Mother Foamer. <laughs> And it looks really funny. The directions say to apply generously onto clean, dry skin, avoid eyes and lips, and watch as your mask naturally turns into foam, leave on for five to 10 minutes, and then rinse off. Again, it does not say what it's for. Carbonated bubble clay mask. It, that's all it says, so let's see. It comes with this little spoon. How does it not foam up in the jar though is my question. Ooh, it looks like slime, like on one of those like oddly satisfying Instagram accounts. <laughs> oh, it feels so weird. Oh my gosh, it literally feels like I'm putting like silly putty on my face. Oh my god. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> Update, it's been two minutes and I can feel I can feel it moving. I can see like from the peripherals like some foaming. <laughs> and it sounds like pop rocks. So a little update, um, it's been about a little over five minutes now and it's definitely grown, it's definitely puffier, it's definitely bubbling a lot more. I can see more now in my peripheral and I hear it popping like pop rocks like crazy so it feels a little tingly, nothing crazy but it does look crazy. Oh my god look how trapped my lips are. Good thing there's a lip mask review coming <laughs> soon. Frances does not like the mask, I have to say. She's been growling a bit. <gasps> I know it's scary, sorry. So, the 10 minutes is up. I'm very puffy. I have a patch missing from my chin because I was laughing and it floated off. <laughs> But I'm gonna wash this off and let's look at the result. Okay, so I just washed it all off. I have to say it was very difficult to get it off. It turned like very slimy, like the consistency when I first put it on. So it was hard to get everything off. But I, I have to say that my skin feels really smooth and so I just looked up some reviews on it during this process and it says that it's meant to, the benefits are that it deep cleans your pores and smooths out your skin if there's any dry patches or anything, which I, I can definitely tell that it my skin feels like really very smooth. The only thing is my skin also feels a bit dry. I don't know, maybe the clay is a bit drying. Um, it's not very moisturizing, but it is super, super smooth. So. I think, you know, I think it worked for the most part and it was fun, made some cute Instagram stories for it, <laughs> but it's a fun mask. I, I really like it and again, my skin feels great, feels clean and smooth. <laughs> so thanks for tuning in and if you try it, let me know, comment below.